Hello and welcome to the Dave Verdan Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Greg Royce, joined by Stevenson Track and Field Head Coach Dave Verdan. Coach, um, one well, of your busiest weeks of the year, one of your biggest weeks of the year coming up, uh, Matt Conference Championship this weekend. It's Friday and Saturday in Alvernia. Uh, talk about kind of the state of the team heading into the weekend. Yeah, so I mean, both teams are really positive. I mean, the men, they've won the past two years, so they, they would really like to win it again, but we really try to emphasize that it's not a given, and I think it's going to be closer than ever. I yeah. mean, two years ago, we tied with Widener, so... Um, I'm thinking it's going to be a really close, close meet on the men's side. And then the women were looking to improve on the top five finish from last year. Yeah, absolutely. First, you know, on the men's side, you know, obviously, um, you know, had several outstanding individual efforts from uh, Pat, Idris, uh, Derek Davis, and uh, Scott, you ranked 11th in the country right now. But obviously that's, you know, those are some of your top marks. Mm -hmm. And obviously the win in any conference championship, you need that depth. And uh, I know that's something you've been searching for here uh, the last several weeks. Yeah, we've been really trying to, to figure out who's going to do what events because we, we are kind of lacking that depth right now. Yeah. But um, we're really hoping that some people step up and score points when they're not expected. And that'll kind of help the team yeah. achieve their goals. Yeah. And then talk about on the women's side, you know, obviously, um, you know, the big story is obviously Danica and kind of the year she's had. She's kind of had a monster senior year so far. And, um, you know, obviously you don't have that throws group you had last year to get mm -hmm. you quite as many points. But obviously she'll probably go out and get you some points this weekend and uh, talk about some of the other people on the women's side as well. Yeah, so we definitely have Danica in the weight throw and the shot put. I think she's the top seed in both. Yeah. But then also junior Emily Gates in the distance races is seated pretty high up there. And then some other distance runners like Michaela Sabo. Yeah. Um, another sprinter, Riley yeah. Hinson. Like, we're just looking again, just like the men's side, just to really kind of fill in those gaps yeah. in all the different event groups. Yeah, and um, you talked a little bit about it, but obviously, you know, the women trying to improve on their best finish, um, which is fifth, and obviously the men trying to repeat. Um, you know, and that's exactly where, you know, the conference poll came out, you know, yesterday, and mm -hmm. the men were picked first, and the women were picked fifth. So, um, you know, hopefully, you know, on the men's side, you stay there, and hopefully on the women's side, you improve a little bit. Yeah, that, that's the goal. But like I said, I mean, it's it's definitely going to be an exciting weekend. It's going to be a really close meet. Yeah, and then um, well, I just talked about, you know, new venue this year, Alvernia's new um, indoor mm -hmm. track facility. You had a chance to check it out a few weeks ago. You competed and meet up there. Um, you know, what are your thoughts on that and competing in a new venue? Yeah, so I think it's really great to have a meet, the, the actual championships at a uh, school within the conference. So yeah. it's really exciting. I mean, Alvernia's new facility is, is really nice. Um, so we're really excited to, to compete there. Yeah. All right, Coach. Well, thanks a lot. We wish you the best of luck this weekend, and uh, we'll chat again soon. Thanks. All right, for Dave Verdan, I'm Greg Royce. This has been the Dave Verdan Show.